Well, let's talk about when y'all do show up on site. How do you start studying the problem? Where do you know how to, where, where do you start looking? That, that's a really good question. Your, so, your call was, I have a backup. I, I've got I a backup. backup in so, my sewer line. Yeah, my, my, my dispatch sends me out. The customer's got a backup in their sewer line. Stuff's coming up in their shower, right? So we train the guys or I train the guys and, and, and we talk about things honestly before we even get to your home. So when I'm driving down the street, I'm looking at things like the manholes. Are they in the street? Are they, do you have an alley behind your house? Um, are they on the side of the alley? Like I, I'm looking for those things because I'm trying to get an idea of which way does your sewer run before I even get there. As I'm coming down your block, I'm looking at the neighbor's houses. Do I see any mainline cleanouts in the front yard? Where are the vents on the roof? Our job starts before we've even got there. Okay. Uh, so then once I get to the door and present myself, make sure our truck's parked okay and all that other stuff, I'm just going to ask you simply, uh, once I've introduced, introduced myself, where has this started? You know, let's take a look where it started. Is it still active? Is it still overflowing? Is it still holding water? Um, if not, we'll start checking some things. We'll turn some water on. We'll turn some water off. We'll, we'll go throughout the house and kind of see what's all affected. If everything's affected, then we're going to try and figure out where we're going to go to to access the issue as close as possible. So that way we can try and restore flow. And then that way we can use that camera that we were talking about if we feel needed. Um, that's the best way to describe how I start to look at it. Check things, start, turn it on, turn it off, turn it on, turn it off.